Hi guys, it's been a while. I want to show you my Halloween album that I made for Sherry's Halloween Swab. Um, this is a treat bag, paper bag album. So here it looks like on the front cover. You can see I used the frame that Sherry sent me and some punches. I made this um, die cut, not die cut, sorry, I made that shape by myself and just kind of traced it. And there's a charm there. So I'm going to put it down, which is a bit too big to fit in camera, so I'm going to try. It's very bright today, guys. So let me put that down first. So my boyfriend's dumbbell on the floor there. Okay, so... I have this charm on this side here. It looks like this. Oh my gosh, I'm having a really hard time. Let me adjust the girls. Ooh. So sunny today. My mom's supposed to call me on Skype, so hopefully I can get this done before she does. So it looks like this. Oh gosh, let me get it. Okay, yeah. And then like this. There's some key and a little skull and skeleton there. I love this paper. It's the basic great Yuri collection. There's um, two tags in each one. I'm not going to pull them out. And then um, I use my Tim Holtz thingy here. And here's just the tag. Slides right in there. Just wanted to show you real quick. I used um, a Maya Road envelope and I just um, covered the front. I didn't like the scallop one and I wanted to make it more spooky. So I used my mini zigzag scissors and I used my Tim Holtz rosette die to get that shape punched up there. And then I did some stamping and some journaling. There's a Tim Holtz ticket and some charms. And there's a tag in there. There's another Tim Holtz um, bossing folder. Some stamping. Beware, my, um, that's um, making memories. Metal plaque, I guess. And that's some um, from the Hundred Yen store I found. And this one, um, I've got little bats hanging from it. And then there's little fuzzy spiders. I did some flocking. And I did some stamping on the background. There's that, I cut this um, apart to get the bats and put some bling from the Honey End store again. There's some embossing, inking, another thing. Some stamping, cutting out, layering. Another one of those ones. I use my recollections bling there just a little bit and then some more spiders Tim Holtz die and then there's that at the bottom there with a jack-o'-lantern up top Tim Holtz key one of my flowers um, this one and then some some punching and that is what the album looks like and then there's the back and this is my information so really simple as you can see I love that I can use it like a treat bag so my partner or the person who receives it will like it it's secret swap so and I have this um, goodie bag that I put together this is actually for Sherry so she's gonna get this charm and I just took a plain paper bag and I cut a couple pieces of paper there's a black paper punched it twice and I put stamped on the green and then layered and then I just put the cord through there so I wanted to show you the cards that I made to um, swap with Sherry. I was really busy so I'm just going to send a few this time and then next time I'll send again. But there's some more here so i am just do the first one. Happy birthday. And then just a couple things in there. This is my favorite, absolute favorite. This is Let's Fly Away. The cat's pajamas. I love it. And there's bling. Lots of layering. The sky's the limit. That's my favorite cherry. Hope you really enjoy that. Fly me to the moon. It's another cat's pajamas. It's hard. There's the gray bunny and the brown bunny. I, well, you can do it either color, but I just that. I'm going to send her the flower, the sunflower girl. And it's there's nothing in there. And so you can give it to mom or an aunt or coworker. This one it says you're so you're so tweet. And this one says miss you. These are MFT dies, the new birdhouse die. Home is where my heart is, and then there's a little heart there that's cute. 
she's, she's gonna get the um, MFT witch girl. I didn't like how this blended actually, but it's not bad. But I don't. Maybe I just uh, it was oversaturated a bit, but I still like this. Hello, my pretty, and then some piece, some place to write, and then one more birthday card because she likes cupcakes. It's your day, and then eat cake. The, so that's that. And this one more. You make me. And I love that trim on the side. You make me smile. <laughs> Aren't they cute? <laughs> it's like they have you make me giggle, you make me blush, you make me smile. I want to hold your hand. So I just did a really non, you know, a very general card so you can give it to anybody. So I made a bunch of charms that, um, I'm going to give to some friends and pass out. So there's some spider ones. And I alcohol inked them with purple. This one's the longer black one. And these two. And this one's, yeah, these two are like this. And then Sherry's. Let's just show you that. Sherry's looks like this. Lots of beading, small attached ones. There's a little spider web. A skull and a jack o' lantern, and probably pretty much the same charms that she um, has at home. Because except for the spider web, because that was on the from the Honey Inn store. This one's a little double double one. It's a little bit longer. That'll go in the album, and I left it free so she could fill in. So that's my share. Really quick one, I just wanted to put it out there and say hello to everybody and hope you're having fun. Happy fall and hope to hear from you soon. Bye.